Goodwill. You see Pops with the unimpressed walk of shame. And there I am pointing at the Goodwill. There's the Cosby Show on DVD. That looks pretty impressive. See a whole bunch of uh, DVDs and, v and VHSs. Not really that much air. Not really impressed. Here's some. Oh, we found the mother load heel. Some fucking vinyl records. Oh, yeah. You best believe that's good for 99 cents. Oh, you best believe it. Oh, there's one brand new sealed. And then we found Goosebumps books. That's pretty impressive. I remember those as a kid. But we found the mother load here. Extreme Championship Wrestlers. This is the new AEW ring. For $1.99. Look at those flimsy ass ropes. And then we're looking through the DVDs. And I found the mother load here, baby. The mother load. Alfred Hitchcock from the Family Dollar for a dollar. Oh, but it gets better. It gets better. Looking for crabs? Look at this big-ass book called Crabs. Looking for crabs. Yeah. I remember those big-ass books when I was in school. And guess what Joey's going to do? He's like, yeah, I ain't picking that up. Put that back. And then we found the mother load. This is going to be the great thing of the whole video right here. A pooper scooper. Jumbo pooper scooper. You want to do bulldog? There you go. Look at these poopy pads here. These puppy pads here. That is, that's real promising. Let's show you how good this video is going to be. Here we go. Gilligan's Island. There it is. In the skipper too, but it's not in there. Someone Gilligan their ass out of there when they took that shit. And then we found the mother load right here. Look at this. Toon Factory. Digiview Entertainment. And that's what we've been looking for all day. But guess what? Hell, they even stole Digiview Entertainment. That's how embarrassing these motherfuckers are. I'll be embarrassed fucking buying that DVD. As you see, there's a Treasure Hunt DVD over there. You can see how impressive that is. And there's... He thought that he thought that was a Wii Sports. He should have known it wasn't going to be. And here we go. Here's some more, here's some more VHSs here. Look at that. Fucking sports bloopers. Yeah, you think I'm going to buy that? No. Here's some more CDs. Ain't really much there to look at. And look what we found. Ratchet and Clank. Up your arsenal. Up your ass is what, I, what it should be. And nothing in there. No shock. Typical Goodwill for you. That's no shock. But wait a minute. We did find it. There it is. Look how fucking beat up. It's like a used sofa. Look how horrible that fucking thing looks. Wait till we get to the back here. Yeah, show the back. Look how fu- You know that ain't playing on no PS2. That's a waste of fucking money. And look at these Stephen King books. Wait till we see the price. 75 fucking dollars, no thanks. You know I ain't buying that. Look at look at all these Star Wars that's over fucking priced. Look at that. Even the Pez's is over fucking priced. Even the ones that are already opened. And there's a nice webcam there for four bucks. Oh, five bucks. Same difference. And there's a whole bunch of other dumb shit. Uh, you want some lamps? You can come here for some lamps. They got some... Oh, there's the Whittle Baskets again. Oh, Dungeons and Dragons, baby. Nobody wants that shit. And look at this. Look at this GameStop controller. Eight bucks? No fucking thank you. Take your mad cat's ass on somewhere. And there's a great uh, HDMI cable. Oh, there we go. There's Mr. Potato Head for five bucks. That's pretty cool. And as we see some, there's uh, Monopoly Empire. Yeah, fuck that game. There's some more kids toys there. M not much really impressive. And look at here. Look at this. There's the, oh, there's the, the Wii Move there. Where the fuck it is. Fuck that goddamn system. And there is a skateboard. You can be the dynamic fucking dudes if you want to be. For seven bucks though. Look at this motherfucker. These bootleg games for 20 bucks. No thank you. Overpriced. Hello, everybody, and welcome to another exciting installment of Wrestling Rampage. The two amigos are back in this place. Tommy. Yeah. Uh, we went to a few places. Yes, we did. Found a few things. Um, uh, and can I say some <laughs> biggest news in the world? What's that? I found more than you. Tommy has quad uh yeah yeah quadru well no 
tripled what I bought. Yeah. Uh, or actually what I got here. Yeah. Um, and uh, what is this? It's a hodgepodge between a couple of places here. Uh, guys, Goodwill has became a complete bust around here. Yeah. There's another one being built here. Hopefully that one will have a lot better shit. Yeah, uh, when it's fully built, we'll go to it, see if we can't find anything, but the one Goodwill we have in town is... It's horrible. ...is always horrible. It is. And, and it's always kind of been horrible. There's only been a few times that we've actually scored decently there. Yeah. Um, and, and that's only been a handful of times. Uh, and you guys seen in the footage, guys. You guys seen what we see in there. Nothing, really. Yeah. Um, guy, the last time that we went... Uh, and by the way, some of those clips are from... Some of those are from a few months ago, yeah. by the way. Some of those clips are. Yeah. That, that's how long we haven't been really finding anything at Goodwill. Now, granted, we don't go there all the time because every time we go there, it's diminishing returns. Yeah. Uh, we go there, there's nothing. We go there, there's nothing. nothing. We go there... Nothing. Well, hold on. We go there, there's nothing. Or we go there, it's overpriced... Like those, well, like, like those DS games. Well, yeah. Who the case. fuck is going to pay almost for a fucking, fucking mediocre, mediocre fucking DS about game. five disc, five dollar games? Yeah, and they want a fucking nineteen dollars. Yeah, for like pets, tigers. Come and, on, uh, fucking Hannah Montana and fucking you know all these shitty games. I mean, maybe if there was like a Mario game in there or a Donkey Kong. DS game or a or Zelda a, or a fucking Sonic or a Sonic. It might be worth it to pick up, but no, they were literally all garbage games. So I left it behind. I was like, I ain't paying fucking almost twenty dollars for like eight shitty fucking yeah. DS games. Fuck that. And uh, just haven't really found anything. Uh, you, like honestly, and if we do find a game, it's either fucking missing or it's scratched all the fucking hell. It's just like, dude, yeah, guys, Goodwill's been a buster. Right yeah. There. Tommy, you found some DVDs at Goodwill. What'd you find? Yeah, well, no shock. That's the only thing good I see at Goodwill nowadays. Yeah. There's DVDs I want, or, or movies that I watched on TV, and be like, hey, I want the DVD of that. No doubt. What'd you end up Which, getting? Well, one right here that I always see on TV, and I always miss the, and I always get the middle or the end part. <laughs> you never see the beginning. Never see the beginning. Martin Lawrence, Welcome Home, Roscoe Jenkins. Four. 99 cents, so that was right up my alley. 99 cents. So that was right up my alley. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Oh, damn, she's pretty hot. Yeah. I'll bang, bang it. Bang it. I'll beat me up Scotty that. <laughs> and I'll slip into the body on that, too. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. So, yeah. Uh, welcome home, Roscoe Jenkins. So, I picked up that for 99 cents. Oh, uh, you know, about a $4 DVD. Yeah. Well, but DVDs, for... you know, are what they are. Yeah. Uh, what's the next one you got there? Well, I'll pick this one. Shout out to Impact Wrestling. TNA. TNA. Chris Rock and the late, great Bernie Mac. Head of State. Head of State. This is actually a good movie. Uh, I actually watched that one. Yeah, it's a good movie. Uh, for 99 cents, of course. Yeah. So yeah, Head of State with Chris and, Rock and Bernie Mac. Yeah, and, uh, it actually has a cameo of TNA in it. Yes, it does. So, so if you guys want to check that out, there. Uh, you know, another, another $4 DVD. But, uh, you know, for 99 cents, which one would you rather pay, a dollar or four dollars? Yeah. yeah. And and for 99 cents, Kingpin. I've seen this on TV, too. See the middle and end. Never see the beginning. Of course. So when I saw the DVD for 99 cents, I was like, you know what? I'll pick it up. Woody Harrison was in that movie. Yeah, yeah, yeah Woody Harrison, yeah. Nice. So, yeah. This, this is going to be a good movie. I, I remember this movie. It's just I always see the middle and the ending of it. Yeah, uh, you know, I'm telling you guys, fucking Goodwill's a bust. Yeah, so. Um, Kingpin. For 99 cents. Around a 4 or $5 DVD, but still, I mean, you know, if, if you get it for a buck. That's what I'm saying. For a dollar, yeah, you might as well just pick up DVDs. That's the only thing I get at Goodwill nowadays. I only found one thing, and it's right here. It's in this little pouch here. Uh... This is a HDMI cord. Now you're wondering, why the hell did I buy an HDMI cord for? Well, these are very useful. Uh, they're useful in, like, current DVD players. They're, they're Blu-ray players. Uh, 
video game consoles like Xbox yeah. One, PS4, PS3, 360, um, Switch. Um, and actually, I do need uh, and and the, and the plug and play consoles like the Nintendo Mini, the yeah. the Sega Mini, and all those. Um, they require HDMI cords. Yeah. Well, um, I do need a few HDMI cords, mm -hmm. and I found this at Goodwill, and I was like, you know, I'm gonna pick this up. Uh, these are just always good to have around. Also, um, I, I got it for a dollar ninety nine, so I paid two bucks for it. Yeah. These roughly, like, you can buy these online, but they're like five bucks, five or six bucks for like a. I, I'd say this is about a four or five, uh, four or five um, foot cord. Yeah. Uh, eh, about five or six, I would say. Yeah, about a five or six inch, uh, not inch, foot cord. Yeah. Um, and these roughly will cost you about five or six bucks on eBay. So I'd rather pay two dollars. Yeah. Than buy it off of eBay for five or six. So there's that. And then, Tommy, uh, you went to Peddler's Mall. Yeah. Um, you know, you went there, mm -hmm. uh, looked around, mm -hmm. found a few things. Yeah. Um, what'd you find? Well, except that it was a waste of fucking time on who I went with. Oh, yeah. Uh, um, Tommy went with his, um... Ex-girlfriend, I would assume. Yeah, it is now. Uh, yeah, it is now. I don't believe in hallelujah, so I guess that's where you... <laughs> Amazon uh, out there. Sorry. <laughs> Doing everything that we Your can. loss. You know uh, who you are. Oh, yeah. Uh, for PS3, I picked up for EA Sports. I know Charles will love it. If it's sports related, you know Charles will dig it. Yeah. Like he digs those... $20, $25 AEW shirts. Uh, good way to waste 50 bucks, Charles. <laughs> Dumpster fire. I, I still like you, Charles. I oh, still yeah. pick on you. Uh, EA Sports Tiger Woods PGA Tour 11. For the PS3. And it was $6, so I said, fuck it, I'll buy it. Is it complete? It is... Yeah, yeah complete. it's complete. Yeah. yeah. Um... Yeah, that's roughly like around a ten dollar game, but Tom paid six for it. But uh, you know who else would uh, appreciate? Uh, I know this is out of date, so what the fuck does that mean? Yeah. Uh, I know. Uh, I know who appreciate this type of game. Who's that? Oh, our host. The host with the most. The, no, the host who who knows wrestling. I uh, know the host with the most. Yes. Yeah. Um. Yeah. So Tiger Woods. You know he'll approve of this. Big golfer. Avid oh, golfer. He, he sure is. Especially when you hit the garage door. <laughs> uh, so, Tommy, you said around four dollars. Yeah. At, at yeah, I Mall. picked it up. I was like, "Yeah, fuck it, I don't have it. Fuck it." Uh, you found one more thing there. Yeah, too. I found another thing there at the Pellers Mall for the PS3 Top Spin Three. Top Spin Three. And I do have a tennis game, and they weren't too bad. So I was like, "Well, I saw this one. I was like, you know what? Fuck it, I'll I'll buy it for four dollars, and it's complete." So I was like, you know what? Because I heard a lot of people say the top spin games are pretty good. So Made by 2K. Made by 2K. So I was like, you know what? Fuck it. I'll, I'll buy it for four bucks. And uh, it's it, it, it's also around a $10 game. Yeah. So you know, I see it around $6 on yeah. that game. So. And so I was like, you know what? Fuck it. I'll buy it for four bucks. And then Tom was nice enough. He actually found something for me yeah. when he was out there. Uh, I, was, I, I, I was at home asleep. Uh, <laughs> I was on a date at that yeah, time. Yeah, was on a date. And he found this for me. He found College Football USA 1996. Um, uh, from the creators of the Bill Walsh uh, College Football comes the ultimate college football experience. I actually have that Bill Walsh's yeah. college football game. Uh, the only, the only like, real, like, sports games I have is mostly for my Sega. Because, I, I, like, I, find, I always find the Sega... Sports games for somewhat cheap. Yeah. Um, and Tommy was nice enough to pick this up for me. Thank you, Tommy. You're welcome. Well, uh, I knew the price. I know if you were there, you probably would have picked that up if you were there. Uh, and it is, it's fully, it's fully complete with manual yeah. and everything. So, um, 
not not bad at all. For, I figured uh, if you were there, you probably would have picked that up if you would have saw it. Yeah, probably. Especially uh, for the price, four dollars. Yeah, it's four dollars, and uh, according to price charting, because that's what we do a lot of our uh, games uh, according to. And the cart looks in really good condition yeah. too. So, you guys, ever see it out there? College football, ninety six. Um, this game, if it's complete, which this is, it's complete in box, in the case. Uh, it's around a ten dollar game. Tommy paid four uh, four dollars for it. Yep, three dollars and ninety nine cents, and. Uh, yeah, gave it to me. Thank you, Tommy. Yeah, well, well, I figured if, if when you go, you if you found a, a box Sega Genesis, you would always pick them up. Yeah, for a few if, bucks. If, if they're for a few dollars. A few bucks is not bad. So, and then, um, like I said, guys, Goodwill has been a complete bust. That's yes. why we haven't really been there. That's why, like, literally in the past few months, this is all we found. Tommy found a couple of DVDs, and I found a fucking HDMI. Cord. That's it. Yeah. Um, but uh, we went to one more place, and it's not a it's not a place that sells video games. No. But they had video games there, which yeah. is really weird. Yeah. I even saw. I was like, "What the yeah. fuck?" Uh, it was up at the like register area. I guess they had it above up, up at the register. I'm afraid somebody's going to steal them or whatever. But even though they were kind of shitty titles there, if you ask me. But. It was just weird that they actually had video games. Well, one looked pretty decent to me. And that one is the one you picked up? Yeah. The other one kind of looked like... They, they, had, a, fucking... they had a PS3 game. Yep. They had a 3DS game. Yeah. They had a couple of Xbox One games. And a, and a, and a few PS4 games. Yeah. And that was it. But it was just weird to see a place that doesn't sell video games to sell video games. Yeah. And that was Big Lots. Yeah. Um, around around us, we only got one big lots, and I think there was only one other time I said they sell video games, and that was like back like I don't know seven eight years ago maybe, yeah. <laughs> uh, back when the three hundred and sixty was actually relevant, uh. And that was the last time I remember, and the Wii was, yeah, it, it was right around that Wii 360 yeah. era. And they were selling, like, used games. They weren't even selling new games. They were selling used games. And uh, that was the only time I remember Big Lots had been selling video games. And, Tommy, you, you, found a, you found a game that you wanted yeah. to pick up. What'd you get? For the PS4, it was six bucks. Ain't too bad for a new game, actually. Yeah, it's not bad for a new game. Eight to Glory. The official game of PBR. PBR. So I was like, you know what? Fuck it. I'll buy it. Do you know what PBR is? Yeah, professional bull riding. Professional bull riding. So I was like, you know what? They look pretty good on the back. As you can tell, it looks pretty decent. Yeah, graphics look pretty good. So I was like, you know what? For six bucks... That's actually made by uh, THQ. Yeah, it's made by THQ. I was like, you know what? For fucking six bucks... I'll 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 buy it. So give, give it a shot. Huh? Yeah, I'll give it a shot. Let me see that. The Looks pretty good. The official game of PBR. Yeah. Actually, sounds decent. I ain't gonna lie. You probably wish you would have grabbed one. Uh, you know, it's a different type of game. It's a different kind of game. But uh, for the PS4, and uh, it is still brand new sealed. Yeah. And uh, according to like price charting. A new copy of this game is like thirteen bucks, so yeah. Tom actually saved around seven bucks on this. Yeah, so I was like, because it's rare you ever find video games that are fucking big lots. Yeah. So I was like, you know what? Fuck it for six bucks, I'll try it out. So, so yeah. uh yeah, that that's our, li our little pickups. Yeah, for our little you. pickups for you. Yeah, not nothing really special because Goodwill's been a bust. Uh. You know, Pillars Mall is some, hit and miss. Is, 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 is it's always hit and miss, and then uh, out of the blue, a uh, Big Lots had a few fucking games, and Big Lots had a few fucking selling a few games. It's kind of weird, yeah. but nonetheless, uh, that's what we picked up uh, and got. Uh, we hope that you guys enjoyed the video. If you guys did, make sure you guys give it a thumbs up. And don't forget to share over social media. Like us on Facebook, facebook.com slash wrestling rampage two. Follow us on Twitter at Russell Rampage as well. As uh, follow uh, me and Tommy on Instagram. Yeah. 
Make sure you guys hit that subscribe button because we're on that march to 3,000 subscribers. Get us that 3,000. Yes, mark. get us to that 3,000. We got a big a giveaway. Huge giveaway coming. Three winners. Big giveaway. And, uh, yeah, you guys don't want to miss it. So make sure you guys hit that subscribe button for more great videos coming to you guys because we're that cream that rises to the top. Cream of the crop, and nobody does it better.